guys, what's up? And we're back to another video. Today, I'm gonna show you how to download the Ice and Fire Dragon mod. So please make the subscribe button and those are videos and let's get started. Okay, so guys, I know some of you have been wondering how this is, how does this dual get this mod on his computer? Well, I'm gonna show you how to do that, which is the Ice and Fire Dragon mod. I've been doing it a lot on my channel because um, it gets a lot of views and it's pretty good. And I like doing it because it's one of my favorite mods in the whole entire world. So like I said, I'm gonna show you how to download it. So the first thing um, you wanna go to is um, Chrome. And then you wanna search up, um, uh, you wanna search up Ice and Fire. Bean Fire mod. Okay, so you go to Ice and Fire mod and it says Ice and Fire Dragons Mod Minecraft Curse Horde. You wanna click on that website and then you go here. And then, now the second thing is, see, it shows all, um, all this stuff. Whoa. Okay, so you wanna go to here on your side and it says Minecraft 1.16. You wanna hit that um, download sign on the side one, two, one, and downloading now. Just don't mind all the other stuff. Chance. So, um, all you want to do is um, keep and then drag it to your desktop if you want. I probably have too much mods. It's not even gonna work. So, the next thing that you wanna go is it should have um, the links right here. So, this mod requires Sitial. So, you can go to the. Um, the link that they put on here, or you can just um, search up studio. Probably spelled that so wrong. Okay, there we go. And there we go. Okay, now we go here. We go to the side, and then 1.16.5 right here for so Minecraft 1.16. So you download that, and as we come here, okay, downloading now. Well, we keep. And then the next website that we want to go to is um, the Forge. Because you're going to need Forge to run this. So we go to Forge, download uh, Forge, Minecraft 1.17. And then you want to go to the side, which is on the left. And then you want to hit 1.16 and then the latest update, 1.16.5. Because Ice and Fire doesn't do 1.17 yet. So yeah, that's going to have to wait. Then we're gonna go down the latest, follow whatever this goes up to the right, and then you hit skip and then keep. Now, um, all you want to do is find your .minecraft folder. This is going in the folder, and I already have um, a little cheat sheet to get there, which I'm now in my .minecraft folder. It has all your data packs, um, and then your mods folder and saves folder, so you wanna go there. And hit mods. Open. Oh, don't mind all of that. Just drag all that out. And then, so you go here. And then you can drag all the mods down into the mods folder. And then don't want to download. Put the forge in because it's um, that's not a mod. But you um, you can drag it. You can double click it, and then it will pop up this right here. So you use, it hit install client and then okay. It automatically puts you on install client, but you can change it for whatever you're doing. If you're wondering for a server, okay. And then it's gonna do this whole thing. And then it downloads into your Minecraft. So when you go into your Minecraft main page, you see this right here all the way on the side, Forge 16.5. And then you hit play. And then I, I, I understand the risk. Is it something that's. Yeah. Okay, and then we're going. And then it's gonna load all this stuff. Okay. So, um, you know, you can do your worlds going into the dragon thingy. Okay. And we're here, 
you know, doing another video. Um, so, um, guys, if you, um, if you enjoy this video, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And it was I, Vito. Bye.